Yeah. <laughs> Harry Potter creator J.K. Rowling is one of the most famous authors in the world. Now she's writing under a fake name. As Elizabeth Palmer reports, the biggest mystery about her new novel has just been solved. The book at the center of the caper is The Cuckoo's Calling, a detective novel penned by one Robert Galbraith, previously unknown. Critics liked it when it was released last April. In fact, one reviewer called it a scintillating debut. And the author, said to be an ex-military man, was praised for detailed descriptions of women's clothing. But sharp-eyed readers noticed that Mr. Galbraith shared an editor and publisher with the superstar author J.K. Rowling, who wrote the blockbuster Harry Potter series. And eventually, literary sleuths at the London Times revealed the two writers were actually one and the same person. The Cuckoo's Calling, whose sales had been a little anemic, rocketed to number one on Amazon's bestseller list. It's opened up a whole new avenue of writing for her. And I think it's even possible that she might pick up some new fans, people who like to read like classic mystery stories, people who are a little too old for Harry Potter when it started being published. The Cuckoo's Calling is Rowling's second crack at an adult audience. In 2012, she released The Casual Vacancy and spoke about moving beyond Harry Potter on CBS This Morning. I will be happy if I can just keep working. You know, for me, writing is, is nearly everything. It's not absolutely everything because I, my family is so important to me, but I need to work. I need to write. The Harry Potter series, seven volumes about a junior wizard, sold over 450 million copies worldwide. The Cuckoo's Calling is proof that J.K. Rowling's pen can still work its magic. For CBS This Morning, Elizabeth Palmer, London.